New at noon, a retired probation officer is in trouble with the law. After nearly 40 years on the job, he is accused of pulling off a scam to get money from some of the people he was supposed to be supervising. CBS Source Ted Scouten joins us now live from the Broward County Courthouse with details. Ted. Hey, Randall, well, right now that probation officer, the retired probation officer, is in the Broward County Jail. He was here at the courthouse earlier today going before a bond court judge asking him to reduce his $30,000 bond. Judge, $33,000 bond is, uh, I believe, excessive in this case. Ricky Bell is a retired probation officer who worked for the Department of Corrections for nearly four decades. Now he's accused of ripping off eight people he was supervising. According to investigators, he pulled off a fraud scheme from November of 2012 until March of 2014. He's accused of depositing into his personal account the money his victims would give him to pay court-ordered costs. In all, he's accused of taking more than $3,300. He asked for a lower bond. Prosecutors argued it should remain high. I believe these are serious offenses. He did these while a probation officer um, and over people that were on probation. We also learned he's being held in solitary. His public defender was hoping that would help sway the judge to lower his bond, making it possible for him to get out of jail. Judge, as you can see, he's wearing a red jumpsuit, which means he's on 23-hour lockdown. Um, I think this is an excessive um, form of, of uh, confinement um, for this man who's never been charged with a crime before in his life. Well, maybe, um, maybe again, for his own safety. And in the end, the judge did decide to lower his bond. He cut it in half. Now it's at $15,000. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.